We've already added a push button and a temperature sensor. Now we're going to add a photocell so that we can measure how light it is. This cadmium sulfide photocell changes resistance with the amount of light falling on it. It'll have a low resistance down around 1K at uh, bright light conditions. It'll go up considerably higher, up to 5 or 6K when you cover it with your finger. If I put it in series with a resistor going from a positive 5 volts down to ground, I get a voltage divider. And the voltage in the middle will vary depending on the resistance of the photocell. I tried several different resistances and finally settled on using this 2K resistor, giving me a reasonable range of voltages. Now to trim the leads and find a way to shoehorn it in. I think I can fit this lead in to that row in between the two leads on the button and take up the least amount of space possible. Let's see how it works. The push button is doing what it should be doing. The light sensor senses when I put my hand in front of the illumination. Finally, when I put my finger on the temperature sensor, it warms up. Let's swap out that black button for the big yellow button that I like better. Then test again. Then we'll tidy up the wiring to give us as much real estate as we can for other projects. Then test it one more time to make sure everything's just so. We've put a bunch of these pieces together, and it's not a perfect solution. I'm sure you can do better yourself for the next lab session.